All right, I'm currently editing this video right here, but then I just thought that I have to do something right now before I forget. I could have sworn yesterday. It said there were 12 hours left of this event, meaning I had missed everything else. I just bought this tier. It's like back in the day where did you want something in the battle pass, but you didn't get it because you weren't good enough. And then you have to live the rest of your life knowing that you didn't get that certain skin. You didn't get that certain emo. That was not going to fly by me, but luckily we got this statue and all this other ore that I'm just going to claim right now for my own satisfaction of the noise, not because I really care about the ore. Wow, there's a ton is it over okay now it's over and then what just spend the rest of it on ores duh there's still so much i can buy i might just spend more money i guess we can do what a single upgrade on the shield never mind two three. Oh, we're so close Ooh, 600 raven medals for 100 frick we're short looks like i'm about to get hacked only 300 gems later but we can finally max it out Wow. Yeah, then at this point, what else do I max out? I guess vamp stash. <laughs> I mean, that's all the way down in the dirt. All right, I gotta get back to editing now. Actually, we have to place an obstacle. <laughs> My freaking God, there's nowhere. It's gonna just infest the whole entire base eventually. All right, back to editing for real. It's currently a Sunday night, 9.38 p.m. The builder base Tesla that we actually started three weeks ago is finally finished. I'm not sure if I want to stream it or make it a video, but I want to completely max out this whole entire section. And they're so freaking expensive. Then all I can really do with the elixir is just put it into walls. I never record this late. Actually, hold on one second. I just thought I'd check the time on my watch that I totally have on my wrist right now. So, whoa, what's happening? Whoa, did I just get a free Barbarian King skin? When they add Buzz Lightyear, he also needs his Sheriff Woody. And yes, this is the reason why I started recording at this time. I normally record during the day. Oh, matter of fact, we got a Dark Elixir, so we can just get this to level 5. And that's about to be halfway done then. I keep distracting myself. I hopped on because the raids are about to end in a few hours. And it looks like we're at the tail end of this one, meaning once we're done with the Barbarian Camp, we're just going to waste every single army into the Capital Peak. We've unlocked the Skeleton Spell. Another fellow YouTuber hit me up. I think those are the only words that i gave about this guy if you guys want to please check out his channel this dude is the god of geometry dash he's the one above all he is very good he's the best player in the world i don't even know why he watches my videos but he does so if you want to check out his channel please do so and he said to use only the hog riders and the skeleton spells so i will be giving it a try hmm i still have five space available should i do the super barbarian or the barbarians with the battle ram the super one. Oh, well, i guess there's not much to it right now i don't even know how the skeleton spell works i'd assume it's just like how it is in the main base right uh except nothing happens that's freaking awesome isn't it did my game break wow don't we love that when you get it when you have a spell no i want you to jump the wall please so oh, i freaking hate you oh some spawned that took a while now they're all spawning i don't get it is it like set so where a hog rider dies let's say and he gets reascended into the pit i'm so confused i don't even get it they have to kill the giants too for it to be a hundred percent i wait no they didn't they just did that for literally absolutely no reason where are you going now oh okay we just had to waste our time to kill the clueless giants that are looking at only god knows what the freaking rainbow maybe because it's pride month they're just looking at the rainbow dilly daddle Diddling, and then they get jumped by a whole army of hogs and skeletons just because frick those giants right yeah i don't know what the strategy is here these look like pros maybe the strategy will start with destroy the giants first because they need to be killed in order to complete the path so do i do this and does the skeleton spell stay on to the next game as well like all the others there's no skeleton spawning after all the hogs are dying so i actually don't know how the spell works at all that was fan freaking tastic it does stay oh <laughs> They went around. They didn't want to attack the town hall that has the eagle artillery's power inside of it. They wanted to attack the things that don't matter. So, when I place a jump spell, it opens up this area. They're flying over the ground anyway. Why does it have to be when I place the jump spell on a troop that doesn't even need the jump spell? If they do not destroy this machine, this is rigged. Okay, it's not entirely rigged. It's still a little bit rigged. I lied to you. Is it even worth watching? No, probably not. Because we know what happens. The skeletons will work the whole entire game to destroy a wall. And then they'll take a few tile steps and then get blown up. That's how it's happened every single time. Honestly, this combo is way too overpowered. I think we destroyed the capital in four attacks? or three let's see if the giants have a chance against ninjago's skeleton army and all the hog riders 
<laughs> nope, doesn't look like it. Well then, and I still have one more raid somehow. Does this mean that we get to do this in one attack then? What is that? There's angry piranhas flying out the fish tank. Oh, that's unfortunate. It looks like we're all out of attacks. I get asked, why are you so depressed all the time? It's because I don't have any more clan capital raids. Time to spend every dime on these walls. Oh, shoot. Maybe I should have put it towards the storage spells. Aren't I so good at reading? I said storage and then spells. Well, now that those raids are over, my fun's ruined. So me recording this now, I have no idea how many days it's been since the last recording. I can't even remember the last time I streamed. I think it was two days ago. I'm not too sure. But that stream was easily my favorite stream ever. For some reason, Isaac Y pulls up. It could have been any YouTuber, right? It could have been anybody. But... It's actually one that I actually like. Freaking DreamWorks going fishing for a, the only good part of his base, which is the Town Hall 13. But then you look at the rest of the dumpster and it's all wooden and stone defenses. Wait! Isaac, why? Isaac, why? And I am being a total fanboy right now, but I do not care. Like, this dude just pulls up to the stream, lets me rate his base, but I was rating bases, and so it gave me the idea that maybe I should let out a community post saying, drop your tag, and then I'll rate your base. Oh my god, 72 comments in 38 minutes? I thought it was gonna be half of that, maybe even less. It's crazy to think about. He could have been doing anything else with his day. He could have done anything else. He could have been using the toilet. He could have taken a shower. He could have been playing class of clans on his own he could have been doing this clan war attacks but he decided to show up to my stream so isaac if you are watching this thank you all right i'm done now i'll drop it now purchase delivered i didn't make a delivery what i'm not sure why i haven't bought this sooner as much as i dislike the queen i do like this skin a lot and she's still shooting up a place while we left the screen. Oh, he's available. Yeah, I know I talked a lot of smack about this guy, but he's actually coming in clutch. Eight hours doesn't seem like a lot, but when you get to do it pretty frequently, it saves so much time, more than you know. One day in 16 hours is way too long to wait for. Oh my god! Wait, how many gems was that? I'm gonna have to watch that back, because I think that was like in the triple digits, and I thought it was in the single digits. We gotta watch back the footage. It was way too long. It was 343! Oh wow, I am such an idiot and it's 180 grand to get to level six is it even worth upgrading him because i know i'm not even gonna like him as much as the yuck maybe it's actually not a bad idea to max out the phoenix i mean we have to max out everything regardless because i'm not a sorry loser rusher but i might actually use him for the main set of pets because there's a specific one that is really dumb the phoenix is just like the unicorn but a million times better so yeah i think we're gonna have to give the queen the phoenix and i know a lot of you guys are probably annoyed right now and probably are about to leave a comment saying no you put the phoenix with the king no the king and the yak are symbiotic it's like the eddie brock and venom you can't separate them they have to be together in order to rule the worlds of clash and i've been doing attacks on my free time i've been upgrading some walls because they made those easier thank god how does a flame flinger end up inside my clan castle every single time i swear i'm making it the battle blimp so why is it not the battle blimp anybody online there is one person online he better give me troops i have a book of heroes here one in my inventory i could magically get more gems to get one from the shop here and then there's one in clan games which i also have to do i think this only means that we can spend the rest of the books on the phoenix yeah because i got a rune as well and there's nothing else i'm going to spend the dark elixir on the queen is getting the upgrades last and i'm still going by that to level seven battle pass book and we need only ten thousand more to get it to level eight there would be a book of spells i think everybody always has the book of spells inside their pass and then it gets to the point where you can't claim it because you don't have any room so then by the time the season ends you end up getting gems for it i got four in here but i don't want to spend any of my loot on spells because i'd rather put it towards walls oh shoot i can max out bat spells i thought that was the town all 16 upgrade but i guess not i'm going up against in war this silly little buffoon he's got the air sweepers pointing this way the other pointing this way but what he doesn't realize is there's a nice grand entrance for the blimp to fly through and destroy everything unless he has bombs planted all over here so by the time the blimp deploys the troops they all just get blown up and die these upgrades are so freaking expensive how do i have so many magic items for building base i'm gonna spend all this gold on walls no and then the elixir on the wall stop how am i accidentally going to the other side of the base we're gonna use a runa builder gold so then i can max out this tesla the teslas are the worst upgrade in all of clash and whether it's builder base or the regular base it is the worst upgrade because think about it you spend the amount of money that bill gates has in his bank account to upgrade them from zero to max 
And then the thing is, they have the same durability as the unicorn, meaning it'll die in like two hits with it being maxed out. So it's just so pointless, but you got to get it done to max it out. I'm so glad you can buy a tree for 2000 raid medals. And I guarantee there are people in my clan that are stupid enough to pay for it because they'd rather put their capital gold towards the landscaping anyway. Oh, we're trying to get mountain golems to the next level, huh? To level three. Hopefully my contribute is somewhat useful. And I should have put it towards the walls, but I didn't. Is there a way to check in the clan to see who has contributed the most? I mean, this is what I hate about this. I know I didn't put 862,000 towards my clan because I was in another clan for a while. I want to know how much I put towards my clan. I did say earlier that I've been upgrading walls, but I've also been upgrading some traps such as the bombs and the air bombs. We got all the regular bombs done in the stream, I'm pretty sure. At least we got the upgrades going. I should probably leave a note saying that you are going to get bullied if your base is terrible, so do this at your own risk. All right, I think that's good enough. When you're this good at Clash of Clans, you end up getting a nerf, meaning I get distracted way too easily. So like during the middle of my recordings, I'll end up going on YouTube and just browsing through and seeing what's up all the time. 145 comments now. I'm going to scroll all the way down to the person that sent theirs first. So there's 46 minutes ago, and then there's one hour ago. I wish there was an option that said first comment. That would make this way easier. According to my screen, it appears that Cadus 6 disciple 182 has left their tag. No words with it, just the tag. Now, of course, I'm not going to put every single tag inside the game because then this video will be longer than a flight to the UK from where I live. All right, this is the first person. So yes, his king is higher than his queen. Don't worry. It looks like he just got out of Town Hall 10, which he's doing good so far because he's got a good start on his walls. I'm not upset about these defenses because you just got those as well. And yeah, again, I'm not going to be worried about the builder base as much because nobody cares about the builder base. But so far, so good. Nabilrakizia6181 has said, the best base ever with little racism towards the Barbarian King. He... GR. It's it's just tied. He was not lying about the little racism. His king and queen are both level 66, but for some reason, he's giving the queen the privilege first, which I'm not happy about. He does have the builder apprentice walking around. I'm very disappointed. I hate it. I wish nothing but the worst for you. That Nintendork dropped his. I hate Nintendo players for a certain reason. So after Tears of the Kingdom, I made a clan, and so the majority of my fan base were a bunch of Nintendo kids, right? If there are perhaps any Nintendo content creators watching this video, do not share your clan to your fan base, you're just setting yourself up for failure because Nintendo players are not good at this video game. And this is my point proven. Exactly what I'm talking about. He's a Town Hall 12. All I need to see is this little sliver to know the type of play. He doesn't have healers unlocked. I had healers unlocked when I rushed on my mom's iPad in fifth grade and I was Town Hall 6 or 7, something like that. Look at his spell assortment. How do you unlock the poison before the rage? The rage is something you get at Town Hall seven or eight i believe i'm pretty sure it's seven my phoenix is a higher level than all of his heroes combined all of his troops spells and heroes leveled up add up to 32 <laughs> he doesn't have this achievement done <laughs> discover new troops i don't even want to visit but i do but i don't there has to be a joke like i can't tell if it's a joke or not well no it can't be a joke because if it's a nintendo kid then it's definitely not a joke he treats his builder base better than his main base because at least he's got some stone walls in here he's only got wood over here he put gems towards his builder apprentice does he even have the five builders no i think these are his only two builders how did he get all this done with only two builders that's kind no it's not impressive because it only takes about three seconds to place anything that he has on his base but he invested his gems towards the builder apprentice that he does not need by the way because that just saves time off builds there's no reason to have him save time off builds that take about 10 seconds i think to get this to level two it's like a one minute upgrade maybe even less maybe even 30 seconds and yeah i knew he used a balloon attack because that's his highest level troop at level five 31 balloons and that's all he can fit as well because his army camps only have a marshmallow on a little fire pit the only thing i'm happy about is that he got his king a higher level than the queen i'll give you that respect the level 10 clan is so huge i know i just got off topic but these two level donations are so so clutch what's even the point of leveling up the clan again they have not added any extra perks in i don't even know how many years i remember my friend's dad being a town hall nine and he was celebrating the fact that he was about to get his clan to level 10 with the two extra donations being a perk and that was a long time ago that was like back in 2016 or 20 yeah probably 2016 it was a long time ago metra everything production says rate my base and rate it hard i also challenge you to count how many decorations my base has i doubt it's anywhere near as much as mine but maybe it is we'll see i swear they're setting up these tags to be very convenient and easy to find because it's not like it's every single key on the keyboard when you're looking up tags like it actually looks 
decent. A town all 12 is never a good sign. From the looks of his troop levels, it actually seems like he's not a terrible player. And I say it all the time. I know the queen is not as good as the king, but it doesn't mean you have to treat her like an orphan. I don't even know what I just thought about what I just said just a second ago, and that does not make any sense at all. I don't know what I was trying to say, but I'm going to leave it in the video because if this was a live stream, that could not be taken back. He does have a lot of obstacles, but nowhere near as much as me, I'm pretty sure. He chose Team Africa over Team Ocean. I mean, there's nothing really to attack you over. You're doing very well for Town Hall 12 so far. When these Electro Fire Wizards came out, I swear that's the only thing people are upgrading, at least for the average builder base player. They're only upgrading the last troop. Candy Corn says, I've devoted my life to this base. Now, I'm going to have to look up what devoted means because my vocabulary is not too extended. Being focused on that particular thing. Oh, okay. It spells out log. That is so cool. Candy Corn is a Town Hall 13. He rushed his heroes. I'm not happy. I don't understand why people rush their heroes. I don't know how many times I have to say it. He's got a pretty solid hero skin set up. And your walls are abysmal. You got to upgrade those. So I actually had a co-worker come up to me yesterday and he showed me his base. It was a Town Hall 11 and it was pretty good for the most part, except he had max Town Hall 9 walls for his Town Hall 11. And I told him to upgrade those and he said it doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. Would it matter if your head was just split open? Would that matter? Okay, then. So your rushed walls matter as well. I stopped arguing with him because I was just so disappointed. Candy Corn, upgrade your freaking heroes and your freaking walls. Seven-tailed beast, triple one. Just a bit of a warning, though. Don't look at the queen and king's level. That's like telling me to stop being white. It's just not gonna happen. That's the first thing I look at when I rate your bases, fun fact. Just in case that wasn't made clear enough. Of course. And it's the people that have good potential that actually max out other things, but they make sure the queen gets it first. He's got the good scenery with the yaks in place. Because your queen is three levels higher than your king, I'm gonna give your base a three out of ten. And then he puts more effort into his builder base than his king level. I don't like this guy. A better base than Jaden's. I'll be the judge of that. Nope, it's already not better. Nice try, pal. He doesn't even have a maxed weaponized town hall. Oh, yeah, fat chance. Yeah, base better than mine. Okay, pal. And I also have the tooth fairy on speed dial. One string of my P does more damage than four of those combined. This dude's terrible. Like, his walls are good, but he made sure to make sure some of the cannons and the wizard towers are town hall 10 level out of every single thing he couldn't put inside the wall. He decides to put in the builder's hut that doesn't even have the weaponized ability, meaning it can't repair anything. It just sits there. Don't want to spoil you, but you'll be pleased. I'm already not pleased by your clan logo banner. And from his hero levels, I'm pretty sure he's maxed out. Yep. I'm unsure of what else he needs to upgrade. Wow, he's not even rushing his builder base. I always have a lot of respect for people that do that. How are you only allowed to have three defenses on this side? While this side has enough defenses to make sure the president doesn't get assassinated in his sleep. That's freaking weird. You know what? I am pleased. Good job, player. I've spent my parents' life savings on this. Well, you didn't spend enough money. You have not spent even close to enough money. How is he a town- Oh, I was about to say, how is he a town all 12 without the royal champion? But you get that at 13. I'm very slow in the head. Yep, of course. It's always the town all 12 players. Why does it say it's level four here, but it's level five on his base? Is it possible? For it to be somebody that's not a town hall 12? Maybe. I don't think I've ever visit someone that does not have the clock tower built on their builder base. Honestly, that's a huge strategy to put all your walls around the level one archer towers. Just to have a barbarian just kick off the legs of the tower and have the whole thing fall. Because it's made of twigs from a fire pit. Honestly, the clan name fits your base. Let me see your clan leader. I need to see the guy that recruited you. What is wrong with him? A very good town hall 11. Oh god, there's a 14. That's pretty low. That's lower than a town hall hall 11. I'm actually getting a headache. I, I don't know if it's like because I've had a headache all day or if it's because I'm looking at these bases. I'm not even joking. My head really hurts right now. I'm going to get off for now. It is currently the next day since I've had that headache. I believe that's how the last episode ended. I had a headache and then got off because I was disgusted by some of the bases that we're going to continue to look at, by the way. But isn't it crazy how much can happen within a few hours? I was at work. It was like 10 p.m. And all of a sudden, now Supercell is getting trashed on by the whole entire community at the moment. People are sending me messages worried about me. So let me just give you a little rundown of what's going on. I'm not going to explain every single detail because I don't want to go that far yet. But if I have to, then I will. Pretty much from the looks of it, Supercell abused the copyright system on a small channel that had a total of 20,000 subscribers, 
which is way less than me, which is even scary to think about because 20,000 is still a big following. The channel went by time to clash. They got a total of 20 copyright claims from Supercell from what it appeared to look like. And all those copyright claims led to a total of no more channel for you. And I don't know if any of this is entirely true, but they also allegedly went after the guy's Twitter and his Discord just so they would not be able to speak out for themselves. But somehow a huge, a bigger YouTuber got attention from it and he made his own video about it and now we're at the situation we're at now. I talked a little bit more about it on my Instagram story. It's always linked in the description if you are interested. I just don't want to go too deep into it on a YouTube video, but again, if I have to, then I absolutely will in the future, but I'm fine at the moment. It's just sad to hear that all of this is happening. There's just been a lot of garbage going on lately with the company, but let's move on from that from now and let's just get back to doing what we were doing yesterday. I don't want to wait 30 freaking minutes. Actually, you know what? Why don't I just spend one of the 50 clock tower potions? 49, sorry. It's a full 30 minutes too. I don't know if I've ever used one of those potions before. The apprentice builder is going to wake up from a snack break in about 48 minutes. How does it have 764 comments? Yeah, I'm just sorry, but there is absolutely no way that I'm going to be able to do all 764. There was a certain one that grabbed my attention while I was at work yesterday. Started playing last September, but I've had many people tell me that I'm lying for some reason. Lol. I got Max Walls Town Hall 13 in my first three months of playing and have been trying my best to unrush. Also, I've always wanted you to review my base, but I can't leave my clan, so I hope you see this. I don't know what leaving your clan would have anything to do with me seeing your base. Unless if you thought maybe for a chance that your stupid little mind thought that you would join my clan. Okay, and I also got people telling me that I can copy and paste the tag, apparently, but no, I cannot. I'm... I swear to God, I've tried it before. Every single time you saw it in the last cuts from before my headache, I was typing it in manually. Yeah, he sucks though. He upgraded his electric owl, the highest, before everything else. I can't be too disappointed because if I was rushing, I don't think I would ever upgrade the wall crusher or the wall wrecker. I don't even know what it's called. Nobody ever uses or speaks of this. Yeah, those ones are pretty valid to max out. I can't lie. I mean, don't, don't get distracted from the fact that your whole entire layout sucks when it comes to troop levels and you don't even have dragon riders unlocked. I had those unlocked when I was a town hall 14. You don't have headhunters either. That's swell. You also probably don't have a father. Oh yeah, he's terrible. I seriously don't get it. He He's trying harder on his walls than the whole entire base. And it's not like the walls are connected. So if this whole point of the base is to protect the loot, he's got the open wall strategy on every single available tile. I don't think I've ever seen a maxed out stone slammer. That actually looks really cool. That's the best looking thing on this guy's base. Fun fact. I thought that said lean the cube, like lean, like sip and lean. You know what I mean? I actually accidentally rhyme all the time. I think I should just become a rapper if my channel does in fact get terminated. And his builder base is good, which is the creepy part about it. Not sure why I said creepy. It's the strange part about it. No, never mind. His the other half sucks. He treats Clash of Clans like it's Animal Crossing. He pays more attention to the decorations and puts more effort into it than he does the actual important part of the base. And he's got Town Hall 12 level heroes. But his champion is really good for some reason. And his warden sucks. But even then, how do you get to Town Hall 6 with how many months did he say? Did he say three? Oh, since last September. Never mind. It's almost been... Wait, what? Well, I mean, yeah, he did rush to be fair, so it makes perfect sense. Oh my god, I love this guy's comment. My base is very basic, but still thought I might share it. I make it a point to keep my king level over my queen, even if it's just by one. And in parentheses, by the way, I love your vids. The two-minute Lego Fortnite one had me, uh rot laughing keep up the great work just because he brought up the second channel video i'm going to visit this guy's base if you guys want to see the video that he's talking about feel free to watch it it is probably my best youtube video of all time so when you copy and paste it you have to click Control v twice he is the cock master he already lied to me though he said that he purposefully makes it so that his king is one level higher but that's just false information because i've done my own research and found out that you're a liar you know your mom says right lying's oh i love you back again never mind i don't even know if i've seen a single person with the gingerbread king dude up oh my god upgrade your spells please i know dang well you're not using lightning why are, do you have it at level nine maybe you are using lightning maybe you are using lightning oh no he's not entirely a liar never mind he's upgrading the king right now this reminds me of my base i don't know if you did that on purpose i have like all of these obstacles on the bottom side of my base that's crazy and then i see up here he's got the whole trash yard the junkyard i don't know why but the early stages of the mega tesla looks like one of those fisher price batman toy sets that you would get when 
you were like three years old. Okay, maybe it's not entirely placed in the bottom of the base, but that's just what it reminded me of. Fadooba Dooba. Oh, that's actually his username as well. I thought he maybe just gave his iPad to his three-year-old brother and just had him mash the keyboard for a second, maybe. I'll have you know that you're already terrible just due to your hero levels. And and maybe you're, let's say, I think that's a Town Hall 8-leveled Barbarian and Archer. Is this guy, are you trying to like be a loser? You're, you're, you're freaking, oh my God, what are they called? The stupid green, the goblins. They're level seven. Is your goal to become a scumbag? I actually genuinely need to know. He's trying to unlock the super troop version of the sneaky goblin just to get fingers pointed at and laughed at. And his base isn't even that bad. It's just his heroes are terrible and his troops are terrible. The big leagues. Yeah. I bet you had your chest puffed out when you made that clan name. Oh, he's not the leader. Never mind. Who is the leader of this clan? Who recruited it? Connor? Of course your name is Connor. Yeah, that's all I need to know. What are the odds he picks mine? Hopefully not because my base is hot trash. Sorry for the over level queen. <laughs> well, thank you for sharing Block the Great. I'm not too sure what that message was for. Maybe he left two separate comments and one of them has his tag. This one right here just like made me activate memories like you would in Breath of the Wild. Pick me or you will fall off a cliff with a sky shroom. He referenced the old Zelda videos. Someone in the comments section told me that I won't take fall damage if I attached a sky shroom to like a shield and then if I like did the shield surf thing and jumped off a cliff I would have lived. I did it for some reason and died. Should I be surprised? Should I really be surprised coming from a Town Hall 12? It's all Town Hall 12s. Love your videos Jaden. I'll be the judge of that. Wow he's maxing his king for his Town Hall 12. Maybe he does love my videos. Thank you sir for treating your king well. Sir and miss don't mean to assume your gender. Absolutely love your vids Jaden. Love from India. By the way I rushed from Town Hall 9 to 11 so now I'm trying to fix my heroes. We'll max the king to level 50 first then queen. Well I'm sending hate from America. So this guy is asking to get bullied because he's rushed. Oh I found it. Someone else also said like do this base or you're gay and I found the one so now I can't be gay if I do it. One of the replies to that said nah Jaden should do this one and I mean he did ask to be bullied and then the guy under him said Jaden will do this base if he isn't gay. So now I have to do it. So it appears that two other players have already done their research. At least those are the players that have admitted to doing the research. I feel better about my past self playing in elementary school rushing when I was literally a child 12 years old 11 years no not 12 years old that's cap it was I was probably 10 years old we still got people in 2024 who have town hall 8 leveled barbarian kings for a town hall 11 <laughs> Ma matters mayhem matters mayhem let me tell you something those walls that you're upgrading around the town hall i'm telling you that's making the difference B keep upgrading those walls around the town hall because that is going to save your whole entire base cancel this upgrade cancel this upgrade cancel this upgrade make sure to put all of your money towards these walls because that's the only thing that can save you now i mean yeah it is legendary he does fit in the clan called legends it's very legendary of how abysmal bases can be in clash of clans who's the leader of this clan joshua wilson everybody's the same it's like Town Hall 11, 12, maybe 13, and then that's just about it. Why is everybody at Town Hall 11 and 12? Running out of video ideas already? Jason, nerd emoji. Well, it looks like you're running out of brain cells because that is not how you spell Jaden. I don't know where the S is in the name Jaden, but it was a good try. I hope you had your fun with that little insult there because I already know your base is horrible. Oh, maybe it's not horrible. Oh, no, it's not horrible. Ha! Ah, my druid's a higher level. Get fricked. And my yak is a higher level too. You suck. I don't care. Nah, he's not even, like, terrible, though. Actually, he rushed his yak, so he is terrible. Wait, no, I forgot, because they just added the extra five levels to it. Never mind. He rushed his walls. He rushed his walls. Yep, he sucks. He sucks. Why do they make the color of Dragon Riders purple? They're not the Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. And the purple doesn't even fit with anything in Town Hall 16. He's technically a rusher because he rushed his walls. I can't imagine rushing. I mean, I can, but I was 10 years old when I did it. I just reached double digits when I rushed. Jaden, be as rude as you can. I'm really sick of seeing Town Hall 12s. Stop rushing your heroes! It's not even hard! All you have to do is wait! That's all you have to do. There's no reason to rush your heroes. DJ Daffy Khaled says, enjoy. He's had, got his frown upside down for some reason, but he says he's also free to play, by the way. And I can tell you're free to play. Just because you didn't feel like maxing out your... Oh, and your queen's a higher level. You are such an idiot. It doesn't matter. That's not an excuse. Just because you're free to play doesn't mean you're a lot of rush heroes. Very interesting army. If I was suffering in the hospital with a brain tumor, let's say, I still wouldn't rush my heroes. Kratos is currently wishing me the best of luck you know what just take it back delete your comment and do 
not show up ever again. I didn't even read the first part of his comment, even though he literally has the, like, the warning there. I looked at the bright side of his comment, and it got totally overshadowed. Waiting for the update to- Why? Why didn't you have to wait for the update for the queen? The excuses do not make sense. I'm done. I'm not looking at it anymore. Oh my god, my heart froze. Like, it stopped beating for a whole three seconds because of Iron 1380's comment. If my base doesn't get reviewed, I'm pulling my membership. Your move, Jaden. He is not joking around. He is serious. I could just feel his anger. And without that membership, I don't even know how I'm going to be able to pay rent for this month. I guess you could say I dodged a few bullets there just because I visit his base. Hmm, he's going with the doing walls last strategy. He's got a hidden one right here. Is that his only level 14 wall? That's crazy how I was able to even find it. No, there's one right here too. You're doing good so far. Just please do not rush. Don't worry, I'm maxed. It takes one glance at my right monitor that you are a liar. You are not maxed. Sicarda XG7QY, pretty much a PlayStation Plus gift shop code. Uh, are you that kid at school that just lies about crap just because he can and doesn't ever back it up? Like that one kid that would be like, I got all this stuff. I got all this money. I could do all these cool tricks. I could run a whole mile in a matter of three minutes, but you can't actually do it and you never prove it. Are you one of those people? That is a town hall nine barbarian king. You are not maxed. And I think you know, you are, you're a fool. You're a freaking dumb. This might be the worst one. I, wait, no, it's not the worst one, is it? I don't know. Yeah, oh my God. I wanted to make clash videos to actually not only entertain the audience, not only for my own entertainment, but to make a difference. But I'm not doing good enough, clearly. Spider-Man cannot save everyone, and that's the only unfortunate part about it. Being Spider-Man is a sacrifice. You can't save everybody. And for some reason, I actually believed it for, like, I don't know why, but I believed it. When he said I'm maxed, I was actually expecting a Town Hall 16, and I was just gonna make, like, a few jokes, like, because I thought maybe there would be a chance, like, he'd have a pet that wasn't fully maxed out yet then i would just like call him out on that but no he just lied i'm gonna lie dead pretty soon if i keep looking at these yeah man these walls are smart to just place there for the decoration because you definitely can't put one of those walls towards your open wall strategy you have going on here uh someone got kicked from the clan and now there's people wanting to join i thought that said fatherless nope 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 t-4 oh get the frick out of here let me in Jaden. we'll see i don't think i've ever seen alexander get spelled like that no no, you rush your walls. You're not joining. Where's this barbarian king? Where's his king? Where is his king? I'm not leaving until I find his king. I'm not gonna like click his profile to see the level. I want to see it myself. Is it hidden in the balloons? No. Oh, it's on the bottom. He had the gingerbread man. I slightly feel bad. Never mind. No, I don't. I don't feel bad at all because you had you made sure your queen is about ten levels higher. I've been playing half my life. I respect the king and yuck. Assuming that this guy's been playing for a year, he's only two years old, so he is decent. He just refuses to upgrade some of his stuff i never understand why it's always the players that are pretty much maxed out they just they have stuff to spend their loot on but they just choose not to do it just because why would they why would you want to spend your money master p master Ma what i'm not too sure what that means i love you jason wow he's killing it with his barbarian king right now for being a town all 10 or just getting the town all 10 the sceneries look so much better better or worse without all the obstacles i can't tell there's so much more room though without obstacles yeah keep up the great work oh dear god i've been recording for 40 minutes it's only rushed because i wanted the rc for those of you who don't know he's not talking about the toy story one he's talking about the royal champion he's chasing women meaning he is not working on himself he is putting out the worst possible version of himself for a woman that does not care about him. Therefore, I wish nothing but the worst. You only rushed for the royal champion, by the way. You made sure to give your queen a nice level 60 while the king sits at the bottom of the trash bag with a 54. I get messages from women in the DMs every single day, multiple times a day, because my base is so good, because I've worked it up, I've built it to where it is now. And I reject them all. You know why? Because they didn't want me at my town hall 3. But at least while I was at my town hall 3, it was better than your whole entire entire town hall 13. I'm goaded for real with the sauce. Also rate my clan. When he says goaded with the sauce, I think he means a sauce that how to basic would make with a Krabby Patty. Cause his heroes are abysmal. I don't even need to see your clan. Rushers got participation medals as kids. When I was a kid, I remember getting a participation award. It was like a little ribbon. It was a green ribbon that said like, thank you for participating or something stupid like that. We had to make wooden cars and then race them. And I'd always come in last. So I got that award. Hey, I like the, Ooh, I like this guy. 
guy. You are doing great so far. He's even got the correct scenery. Chicken Nuggy, and that's his actual name. Yeah, fun fact about chicken nuggets is when I used to work at McDonald's, if you were to like punch a chicken nugget, it would just completely explode. I wish I can do that with you, just looking at your hero levels and the way you treat the yak. Why is he the lowest level out of all of your pets? He is your best pet. And you're treating him like he belongs in the dog pound with all the other sorry unadopted dogs. Now you're terrible. Your king is a lower level too. You're horrible. And you couldn't be bothered to max out the royal champion, the better female hero. Get the frick out of here. It would be crazy if I was in a video. Wow. You know, I actually like it. I like the way he has fun with his upgrades and stuff. I'm pretty sure these were all getting upgraded. Never mind. That's a lie because these are Town Hall 9 army camps. He just has a little interesting compass design when it comes to his structures. And there is construction going on with an Inferno Tower. I thought that said insufferables, but it says insuperables. I don't even know what that means. And I won't find out what it means because I cannot read. Well, I mean, I can't really read well regardless. I mean, I can. I just don't feel like doing it because it's boring and it's a waste of time in my opinion but you're never gonna catch me read spanish fluently ever nine-year-old me was on meth and i'm only just now starting to recover typhoon typhoon lagoon that's a nice water park in disney world if you guys ever go there you should go there so i know you mentioned nine-year-old you but were you dropped as a baby by any chance so you mentioned that you're just now starting to recover but i got a little riddle for you riddle me this quinn gonna drake and little baby made a song the title of that song is my message back to you let's see if you can solve that one. Oh no i just lost one. Oh, okay i found it found it never mind the worst town hall eight you will ever see please bully me yep he does not have a max town hall seven barbarian king his spells are actually good though i'm pretty sure is he a builder based player is that maybe why i hate to break it to you but i've seen much worse you know what i'm actually gonna expose this person right now i still have people added from my middle school school bus i swear to god there's people that i have have added <gasps> There's people I have added from middle school. I mean, yes, yours was garbage. Don't get me wrong. Oh, it changed because he got the builders to repair stuff over time because when you get off the game for about like three months, I'm pretty sure it's something like that. They do upgrades without you and they upgraded his walls because they used to be golden. But yeah, I'm not going to show his name. I don't want to put him on blast, but yeah, I remember he said that he was a town hall eight and I thought he was really good at the time because I was like a town hall six, but then I saw his base and I was so disappointed, but I was so nice back then. So I didn't insult him and bully him like I would now. But yeah, I don't talk to that kid anymore. Man, the bus went crazy back in the day. It was always Clash of Clans until Clash Royale dropped and then everybody dropped Clash of Clans. And fun fact, I was technically the worst on the school bus, but now I've surpassed everybody. Isn't that crazy? All right, I'm going to do one more base because there's just way too many. I cannot do all over 700. I'm going to close my eyes and randomly pick one wherever my mouse lands. All right, and the final person is not the imposter. Five, four, zero, six. It is not my first time, so go easy on me. Frick! I can't read! It's my first time, so go easy on me. That's what he said. Well, unfortunately, no, because I did put a disclaimer that you will be bullied if your base is horrible. Oh, frick! Yeah, no! No chance I'm gonna go easy on you! This doesn't entirely make up for the fact that you're bad at the game, by the way. I just want you to know that. He's a Town Hall 15 with Town Hall 12 heroes. Yeah, no! You are horrible. You are very bad. I mean, your builder base is good, but your main base is terrible. I would rather look at pictures of myself in middle school than I would to look at this base any much longer i only need 300 more medals till clan games is done and there's only a 14 hours remaining so i gotta get it done now i did not mean to click the boat i meant to click the attack button but while we're over here we can use our boost i love when this happens but i'm not gonna love the bomb planted inside there is no bomb never mind it's always was that a tesla in there is there a tesla or am i blind there is a tesla it's always a tesla i don't know why i don't expect that more oh while i was on the toilet yesterday i want to see if i could find that replay i got the best blimp value of all time in my whole career i mean yes his base was terrible but i got a two-star battle blimp i think it was like a total of 52 percent i'm gonna show you after this raid that tornado trap is the defense of the year oh i gotta place the last baby dragon place it place it thank you that was close we only needed one percent now all right no there's only one day left of the streak i should have taken more advantage i should have played on my free time more i've just been very busy again here i go again with excuses there is no excuse for missing out on clash of clans loot four thousand dark elixir this will be more than enough please go to the why why did you turn why couldn't you just go to the other collector i mean the yak and the king are going to take care of it anyway so frick you soccer ball i didn't need you anyway look at them 
the best duo of all time. All right, I think that's about 4,000. Thank the Lord that's done with. I'll see your fat bird beaked nose in the next month. And we can upgrade one more air bomb. I just had a clever idea. If I buy 500 gems, I can buy a book of heroes. There you are. So then the Phoenix can get to level nine. I'm not sure when I even started that upgrade. Frick! No, it was level eight. Shoot, I messed up because I still need two more books now and this only gives me one. Well, the new season's gonna start pretty soon anyway. In just about three or four days. Oh, man. All right, we're done for now. Thank you all for watching. And as always, you know me. You know what I always say at the end here, at least for you. <laughs> at least for you returning viewers. I'll be seeing you guys in the next video.